Hello, hello, hello. It's Nicole. Nicole is making it happen. And I wanted to pop on real fast to give you guys um, two quick scenarios that I did. Um, last minute scenarios at CVS and Rite Aid. Um, excellent deals on Pampers um, as well as some hair care. So um, I normally don't do two stores in one video, but I've decided to do that in this video. I'm um, just to get this out to you really fast, just in case you wanted to do some last minute couponing. So you're going to need your inserts because you're going to need some of those $2.50 Huggy coupons. And then you're also going to need your um, inserts for the Shea uh, Moisture coupons because those are the paper coupons I use. Um, as well as your PNG insert to get that expired loves coupon. And then I also use some digital coupons from coupons.com. Um, if you have not downloaded Fetch, you're going to need to do that because you're going to get some rebates back from Fetch. I will put my link in the description box as well as in the comments section. So all you have to do is click on that and download it. And when you download it and snap your first receipt, you get 3,000 points, which equals to $3. And then you can convert your points to gift cards. It could be a Visa gift card, a store gift card, whatever you choose to do. And then the other app we're going to use is coupons.com. Um, again, I'll put that link in the description box as well as in the comments section. And last but not least, you're going to need Ibotta. If you have not downloaded Ibotta, guys, you are missing out. With Ibotta, when you scan your first receipt and redeem your first rebate, they're going to pay you $10. And it doesn't matter if your rebate is for a quarter, 50 cent, 10 cent, whatever. You're going to get $10. Just use my code. You redeem your first rebate. You get $10 and I get $10. And then once you've already established your, your uh, Ibotta account, when you send your code to your friends and family, when they redeem their first rebate, they get $10 and you get $10. So guys, this is a quick and easy way with Ibotta to rack up some free money. Plus, I got money back for the loves and a couple of other things. So go ahead, get your pe your paper and your pencils, your pens so you could take notes, get your phones out to take your screenshots. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, go ahead and do so so you don't miss out on any of these fantastic deals. And let's get ready to save. <laughs> Okay, guys, so let's jump right into the deal. So the first store that we're going to look at is Rite Aid. So at Rite Aid, I got um, the Shea Moisture Packets. So I got six of those. Okay, you can see they're the two ounce. And I usually use these twice, but I got two, four, six. Excuse me, I got eight of these. As you can see, I got eight of them. Okay. Um, they are actually on sale, buy one, get one 50% off. So the first one is $3.49, and then 50% of that is $1.74. Now, if you buy two, you get um, $2 in bonus cash, I believe. But I had already done this deal earlier this week, so I didn't get any bonus cash on this receipt for this, but I just wanted to let you know just in case you didn't do the deal and you can do the deal twice. So if I would not have done the deal earlier this week, I would have got bonus cash for that, but I didn't get bonus cash. I wanted to do the deal because of the coupons I had and I use these all the time and this is a great way to basically get them just about free. So you pay, I paid $3.49 for the one pack and $1.74 for the second pack. So actually for the for the two together it will come to $5.23. But I used the $5 off two coupon that came out in last um Sunday in our I believe it was the Unilever um the Unilever insert. So for every two packs I only paid um I paid a dollar twenty three for. Um, excuse me. I paid twenty three cents for.
because I paid a total of $5.23 for every two. I used a $5 off coupon for each one. And I had four coupons because I got a total of eight. So I'm absolutely fine with that. Then the next deal I did, they had um, where you spend 30 and get $10 back. Now, there's a whole bunch of other things that are included in this deal. Um, I believe it's the Depends included in this, the uh, Coltex, but I chose to just do the diapers, the Huggies. So they were on sale for $10.59. So I grabbed three bags, which took me well over my $30. It's $31 and some change. And then I used... The two dollar I used the two dollar and fifty cent coupon on these on the Huggies little snug snuggles. Then I used a four dollar digital coupon on these the Huggies special delivery. That's the load to car coupon off of the um, Rite Aid app. And then for the second bag of Huggies special deliveries, I used a four dollar coupon off of coupons.com. Now, I got all of this because I wanted to use and did all of this in one transaction because I wanted to use my $10 off 50 coupon. Now, because I'm using the $4 off load to car coupon, instead of spending $50, I had to spend $54 in order for that coupon to come off. Whenever you use a load to car Rite Aid coupon, you have to account for that. Um, in your total in order for your $10 off 50 to come off. So I got a bag of M&Ms. Now this is where I goofed up at, but it still end up working out. The M&Ms were tagged for 88 cents because they tagged the sales for tomorrow. And I didn't realize that. So I grabbed these M&Ms thinking I'm paying 88 cents, but actually I paid a dollar. Um, let me get it. A dollar. Oh, where are they at? Actually, I paid a dollar nineteen for those, which is not too bad, especially since I haven't bought a rebate for them. But I would have still preferred to pay eighty eight cents, and then I still wasn't at the fifty four dollars because of tax. So I grabbed this little caramel um, to bring me to my fifty four dollars. So. After all of that, my total that I had to pay out of pocket was $17.72 without my rebate. So that's what I paid at the register. So let me show you my receipt. So there's my Huggies. And the first one I used, which is the red bag, the Huggies Snugglers, I used a $2.50 off coupon. There's my $10 wellness coupon that, that came off, which is the $10 off 50 coupon. There's the special delivery uh, diapers and the $4 load to car coupon came off of that. There's the other special delivery, which I'm submitting to, or I have submitted to coupons.com to get my $4 back for that. Then there's the M&M peanut, then the caramel for 34 cents. And then here are all the Shea Moisture uh, packets, which the first one's ringing up for three forty nine, and the second one rings up for a dollar seventy four. Then you see the five dollar off manufacturer coupon, and you can see there's a total of eight of those, and four five dollar off coupons that came off. So my total would have been seventeen dollars and seventy two cents, but I got back ten dollars in bonus cash. So that took my total down to seven dollars and 72 cents but then i submitted my receipt to coupons.com so there's four dollars for there i submitted my my receipt to fetch where i got three dollars back for the uh little snuggles thing and a whole bunch of cents for the shea moistures as well as the huggy special delivery and then I also got back, let me show you guys, more bonus cash that will be converted tomorrow. So you, there you see I got back 1,087 
1087 bonus points and when you convert that that comes out to two dollars in bonus cash that will be on my account tomorrow at six o'clock so when you add all of that up that comes to a total of nineteen dollars and eight cents that i got back for three things of diapers a thing of um m&ms because i got back from ibotta um which I didn't even include on here. Um, I got back from Ibotta, yeah, 50 cents. I did include that, 50 cents for the M&Ms, okay? So when you add all of that up, I got a total of $19.08 back, and you subtract that from $17.72. That makes this a $1.86 moneymaker for everything on this side, the two packs of special deliveries, the M&Ms, the... Caramel, the Huggies, and the 8-pack of uh, Shea Moisture Conditioner Packs. So now, let's move to our CVS purchase. Okay, so at CVS, I got the Loves. I got a pack of Little Snuggles. I got back um, the Huggies Overnights. And a pack of Pampers Wipes and CVS Toddler Wipes. So I bought the Huggies, two packs, because they were on sale, two for $22. And I used a $4 off digital CVS manufacturer coupon on the Huggies overnights. And then I used a $2.50 uh, paper coupon on the Huggies Little Snugglers. Then on the Loves, I used the $3 coupon from the PNG um, that expired. But, you know, you can still use expired coupons at most CVSs. But let's go back to the Huggies deal, guys. So when you buy the Huggies, the two packs for $22, you also get $5 back in extra bucks. So that's why I did that. But then the reason why I got the loves as well as the wipes and things is because I had a $5 off $35 baby CRT. So I wanted to make sure I got to a total of $35 worth of baby items. So that's why then I got the loves. So with that, I used the $3 PNG expired coupon, but then I also submitted my receipt to Ibotta for $3 in rebates back for that. And then I submitted my receipt also to um, to Fetch for the, the Huggies um, overnights where I got $2.15 back for all of the, the Huggies products. And then I... You got the Pampers wipes, which were on sale for $3 um, this week. They were two for six, um, so $3. And then I got the CVS um, toddlers wipes, which were $1.99. So let me show you my receipt. So there's the Huggies overnights where um, they were $11.49, and I used the $4.00. Um, digital coupon from the CVS app. There's the Huggies Jumbo Pack, which is the red pack where I used the $2.50 off coupon. There's the Pampers Sensitive Wipes, the Loves Diapers, where I used the $3 off coupon. And the Loves were on sale for $8.99. So these are the coupons that I use. Now, again, I don't know what happened at CVS, but there was a goof up at CVS also. It just, today was just not a good couponing day for me. Although this is a good haul, the entire haul should have been a money maker, but I spent a little out of pocket. So remember I told you that I bought all of this to get to $35 so I could get the $5 off 35 baby CRT, but that didn't attach. So that's why my out of pocket was so high. So there's the $4 digital coupon, manufacturer coupon that was in the CVS app that I used for the Huggies overnights. And then there's the $2.50 paper coupon that I used on the Little Snugglers. And then the $3 manufacturer coupon that I used for the Loves. So you see my total out of pocket was $26.48. Now I did get back 
a $5 extra buck. So we'll subtract that. And then I also got back $2.50 from Fetch for the overnights. Um, I got back $3.25 from Ibotta. I got $3 back for the loves and $0.25 cents for any wipes. So when you total all of that, and you minus that from the 20 you minus that from the $26.48 I paid out of pocket. I got back a total of $19.90 in extra bucks and, and rebates. So then I spent $6.58 out of pocket, which is still not bad for three packs of diapers and two packs of wipes. Now, when you put this deal all together with what I spent at Rite Aid and what I spent at CVS, that's what makes this even better. Because at CVS, I had a $6.58 out of pocket, but at Rite Aid, I had a $1.86 moneymaker. So all together, I only spent $4.72 out of pocket for six packs of diapers, eight packs of conditioner, a thing of M&Ms, a caramel, and two packs of wipes. Now, if my $5 CRT would have come off at CVS, then this would have been a 28 cent money maker. And that would have really been nice. And that's what I was going after. But again, you know, I don't know what's going on with CVS's registers, but I'm happy with what I got. Um, hopefully you guys can run out and do this deal. You still have time. These deals um, are good until midnight. So if you have a um, 24 hour CVS, in a 24-hour Rite Aid, you have until midnight to go out and do these deals. So, guys, let me know if you're going to do them or if you've already done them. But I thank you for tuning in. And until the next time, keep on saving.